Okay, how are you all doing today? My name is Kenneth Bird. I'm the creator of Crystal H Technology Projection Screens using Smart Technology Gain. Uh, this right here is the Immerse 4K Cinema Screen Paint. Now, for those of you who are curious to see how I painted the screen, please check at the bottom of the comment section. I will show a demonstration of me actually painting this, this particular screen right here. And also a demonstration that we did with the projector 16 feet back, 2500 lumens suspended under a high power fluorescent light. And it looks absolutely incredible. All right, so today I'm going to be talking about the projector that I have right here. I think a lot of people slept on this particular projector and it has a very interesting option in this projector that I don't think a lot of people know about. Now I haven't seen a lot of videos on YouTube about this projector, so that's why I'm going to show you something, one of the cool options that this projector has. Now, this is a ViewSonic 3200 lumens. It's a DLP projector. It is 3D, has all the cool bells and whistles. But I'm gonna show you something that this projector has that every projector, not most of the projectors I have seen don't have it. All right, so I'm gonna go into my menu really quick. I'm gonna zoom up and show you so you can see this. This projector does 235.1. It also does anamorphic. Now, that is that ultra wide screen you have without the letter box at the bottom. Unfortunately, I do have the letter box here and here around the screen, but I will be measuring this particular size out and I will be cutting and designing me a mini uh, 235.1 screen that I can watch movies off. It's gonna be freaking cool. I'm gonna put a sound, I'm, I'm not gonna tell you how I'm gonna build it. It's gonna be, it's gonna be a cool freaking uh, um, frame and screen all together. Now, I will be using the um, Emerge 4K Cinema Screen Paint. Uh, also, too, um, I will be doing a customized frame, which is going to be mind-blowing. You're going to love the frame when I get done with this. I mean, it's going to be my mini uh, 235.1 uh, widescreen. All right, so let me show you what we have over here because we're going to be streaming this through uh, Chromecast. So I'm going to be doing this with a video that does 235.1. I'm pretty sure you can see that right there. I'm going to be doing this in 720p, unfortunately, because my Chromecast only does 720p because of my cell phone. But, you know, hey, it's just a demonstration to show you exactly how cool this projector is. Now, this projector is short throw. Um, I do have to use a short throw in my environment due to the fact that my screen is 180 inches and I have 13 feet from there to here but since my staircase reaches here I have way less than that so I have to use a sure throw which I don't mind because it's in a large environment actually it's in a sh sorry a small environment so it gives me that big screen now I want to add really quick uh, for those of you that are interested in the Emerge 4k screen paint we do have a, a two cord kit we just launched it's been selling very fast um, it does come with two quarts of the Immerse 4K um, cinema screen paint. Also, too, it comes with a 120 inch uh, surface that comes with it that you can coat. Mind you, our screen paint is weatherproof, so you can take it outside. And the blackout cloth is free. All right, also, too, it does come with free worldwide shipping, so we can ship that to you anywhere in the world. All right, so let's begin. Let me get up here real quick from different angles. Yeah, I'm gonna design myself a little mini 235.1 uh, theater screen. And I won't have that bar at the bottom, that black bar at the bottom, I'm gonna actually cut and measure the screen and rebuild me another one. Here, give you another view. Now, the Immerse 4K is using the Smart Technology Game Times 4. Um, like I said, for me, this is an easy challenge for the screen because the projector is literally sitting right up on top of the screen. So, I really don't consider that to be a, um, um, a um, I don't know, a win-win because the projector is just too close. But like I said, check out the bottom of the video comment. We do have a demonstration with the screen 16 feet back, 2,500 lumens, and actually suspend it from the ceiling right over top, a, um, or right underneath, sorry, right underneath a high fluorescent light. Right, we're gonna come over here for a minute. I'll come over here on this side. Be wide screen. So yeah, when I bought the projector, I had no idea that it could do that. 
I had no idea it had 235.1. And when I was fiddling around in the menu, I saw the 235.1 and anamorphic pop up and I go, oh, you gotta be kidding me. Now, usually a projector that does the 235.1 or 239.1 or any form of anamorphic effect, they're very expensive. They're like a couple of thousand dollars. On top of that, if you want to convert your uh, everyday projector by using the lens, the problem is the lens can be expensive too. They can cost you about a couple of thousand dollars also. Now, I have tried using the wide angle camera lens uh, for the effect, but like I said, you have to fiddle with it a lot. There's a lot of tinkering going on in order to get it to actually accommodate the projector. You cannot use it with a short throw. It has to be used with a long throw. Some of the lenses work, some of them don't work. So it depends on how it goes. That is just the coolest thing ever. I'm telling you, that is freaking cool. And like I said, I never knew the projector had in there. Now, also too, at the bottom of the comment section, Please check out the link. I have a link to Amazon where you can go in and purchase the same projector I have right here, like I said, for only Okay guys, I'm Kenneth Bird from Crystal Beach. Okay, sorry about that. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I'm Kenneth Burr from Crystal Beach Technology Screens using Smart Technology Gain. Hope you enjoyed the video demonstration. I'd like to thank you all for watching. Just gonna play this a little bit longer. Put the lights back on again. this play a little longer. Any angle the screen looks amazing. Screens have amazing angle gain.